Hey guys, in this video, let me share you what are all the requirements to get the Dolby Atmos effect. There are three major requirements. The first one is that, so which device you are going to use, so that should support a Dolby Atmos. So for example, if you are using any Android smartphone, your smartphone should support Dolby Atmos. Once go to the settings and go to the sounds and vibration, here you can able to see the Dolby Atmos uh, option. So if you have a Dolby Atmos option, means then your smartphone is supported with the Dolby Atmos. And the next requirement is that the TWS earbuds you are going to use should support Dolby Atmos. For example, most of the Realme, OnePlus and in the Oppo, Oppo Enco Buds 2 is supported. And most of the Realme and the OnePlus TWS earbuds are supported with the Dolby Atmos. And the third requirement is that you need a Dolby Atmos content. So you will get a Dolby Atmos content only in Apple Music. In India, only in the Apple Music you can easily get, you can easily stream Dolby Atmos content. And in the Apple Music you need to change some settings. So firstly, you need a Dolby Atmos smartphone. In the Dolby Atmos smartphone, install the Apple Music and just to open it. Just to click on the three dot menu and click on the settings. Now here you can see the special audio option. You need to just enable this option. And in case if your smartphone not have the Dolby Atmos means, then you can't able to see this spatial audio option. So only in the Dolby Atmos supported smartphone, you can see this spatial audio option. You need to just enable it. And also in most of the Mac PCs, you can see the spatial audio option in the Apple Music setting page. And But you will not able to see the spatial audio option in the Windows PC if you install the Apple Music application. Now after enabled this option, now just go through to all the songs if the song has the Dolby Atmos format then you can able to see the Dolby Atmos tagline so now for example by default it actually is showing the high-res lossless but after you enabled that special audio option just to uh, go to the next song and again come back to previous song now this song is actually encoded with the Dolby Atmos format which means this song has both a Dolby Atmos version and a high-res lossless audio version also so some of the supported songs you can able to see the Dolby Atmos so you can just go through to all the songs and make the separate playlist for Dolby Atmos content so that you can able to experience the Dolby Atmos effects whenever you want and in case if you actually turned off this uh, special audio option means then if you again go to that particular song you can able to see the different audio format like a high res lossless or you can also see the lossless format as well only if the song has the Dolby Atmos version you, you can able to see the Dolby Atmos tagline so now these are all the requirements you need to feel the Dolby Atmos experience on your TWS earbuds